Hi guys, my name is Rushma and welcome to yet another food vlog. So today I'm trying Newari food. And Newari food belongs to an ethnic community here in Nepal called the Newars. Newars are actually the historical inhabitants of Kathmandu Valley and they are the creators of its historic heritage and civilization. Newari cuisine is the most celebrated food variety in the country that consists of over 200 dishes. So first I went to Harati Newari restaurant at Naya Bazaar which is near Tamil. The restaurant area is built in Newari architecture. They have an open kitchen and the menu consists of a wide variety of Newari dishes. I ordered keema chatamari with egg, chicken momo, fried chicken gizzard and alutama and of course coke. And these are chicken momos? <laughs> The chicken filling is quite rich and it's a little spicy. This is Chakamari like Nepalese pizza and it has a very thin crust, very crispy. It's topped with minced chicken and egg. So the egg holds everything together. And the dip is also very nice. The dip is made of sesame seeds and uh, tomatoes, coriander and some more masalas. These are chicken gizzard, deep fried. Though it's deep fried, it's not very hard. It's soft on inside, it's crunchy outside. It's seasoned with salt, cumin powder and some red chilies. That's it. Problem is fried in mustard oil. Yum. And this is alutama. It's basically bamboo shoot and potato soup. So this is a little bit tangy. Yum. After that I went to Indra Chok where there is this small but very famous place among the locals where they serve Newari food. The place can be a bit difficult to locate if you are going there for the first time. They have a very limited menu and they serve only vegetarian food. They have been running this place for over 15 years now. I ordered two different types of wo, mashewra chwela, mushroom chwela and two types of yomari. Wo or bara is like a pancake made up of lentils but it's not sweet, it's salty. I ordered one made up of black lentil and the other of green lentil. Now how this is prepared is that the lentils are soaked overnight, then grinded, then season the batter with salt and ginger garlic paste and pan fried. I personally like the one with black lentil. They cook it here on a wooden stove which makes the food even more tasty. The mashura chwela which is made up of soya chunks are soaked, boiled and grilled a little to give it a charred taste and are mixed with a lot of ginger garlic paste, red chilli and some more masala and mustard oil. It was so so good. The next item was mushroom chwela. The procedure of preparing it is same as the mashura chwela. It's just that instead of soya chunks, here it is made up of mushroom. Then finally it was yomari time. It's a sweet dish. It is made up of rice flour and stuffed with brown cane sugar and sesame seeds. And they are steamed just like how dumplings are made. 
We have a special day to eat Yomari actually. It is one of the most popular Newari festivals which is observed every year during the full moon in December. So on that day Yomari is cooked in every Newari household. I ordered one with chaku which is brown cane sugar filling and the other with khua which is condensed milk. The dough was so so soft and the fillings were generous, tasty and so satisfying. All the food items were so tasty and cheap. No wonder people come here repeatedly. I highly recommend this place to everybody. So if you have reached this far, thank you so much for watching. Do subscribe if you have not already and like, share and comment. Take care. Everybody likes Nevari food, right? Almost everybody likes Nevari food. It's so good. But I don't know how to explain the food. Okay? <laughs> It's seasoned with salt. What? What? It's seasoned. It's seasoned with salt. And this is all. What? Mukashiya? Huh?